and BBC Radio 5 live presenter Nihal Arthanaika has bizarrely chosen to reignite his own race rap. Last month, he told a journalism diversity conference that an overwhelmingly white working environment at the BBC was affecting his mental health. And despite coming under widespread criticism, Nihal snapped back on social media yesterday, writing, I saw a lack of diversity in my workplace over a long period of time. It's affected me, and it was isolating and lonely. Yet all these GBBs loving types made me to be an anti-white racist. If a single one of them think I'm going to keep quiet, then they're even more stupid. So he's raking in a lucrative salary funded by the taxpayer and he's calling members of the public, like GB News viewers, stupid. He should apologise for his egregious racism. He said that uh, working amongst white people made him feel uncomfortable. Imagine if, uh, if the roles were reversed and this was a white person saying they didn't feel comfortable uh, in, in where, wherever they lived. You know, perhaps it was a formerly white place that is now a predominantly uh, ethnic minority or, or if, if they worked uh, with a lot of ethnic minority people and they said it made them feel uncomfortable. That, that person, they wouldn't just be hounded from their job. They'd be paraded in the streets. They'd be sent to jail. So it's it's absolutely disgusting that Nihal can can behave in the most, uh, you know, in, in a way that would uh, that would get somebody else condemned, and uh, and he seems to be proud of it as well. It seems to be somebody he's, he's doubling down on. He doesn't see the error of his ways at all.